calculate the size of the angle marked x, you must give a reason for your answer. Well, there are only two marks for this question, but so it's got to be quite simple. Uh, however, you have to give your reasoning. Let's label this as A, B, C, D, and E. So, angles on the same arc are equal, so CBA has to be equal to X. Angles on the same arc. are equal or congruent is another word for it so uh, so a b c equals x angles that that has got to be 120 degrees there because angles with the uh, the same vertices by that we mean the same vertex or common point uh, are congruent so that's the same as that one a c b is congruent with DCE as they share vertices. So A C B is equal to hundred and twenty degrees angles on a triangle add up. to 180 degrees so x is equal to 180 minus 120 minus 25 is equal to 35 degrees So here's the second part of the question. Calculate the size of the angle marked Y. You must give a reason for your answer. Um, again, there's only two marks here, so I'm not going to go into a lot of uh, explanation here, but basically saying uh, using the alternate segment theorem y is equal to 70 degrees that angle there is equal to to that one just as this angle here is equal to 68 degrees um, so where you've got alternate segments with a tangent running like that, then that's uh, that's what your angle is going to be.